Ooh, that reminds me. I was supposed to find. Sorry to be such a burden back there. I'll try to be more careful. <laughs> yeah, I was the only one that was dying. Browner pastures. Olympias doesn't seem to be any greener out this way. Nope. Pretty much everywhere outside the cities is like this. If anything, it's a little worse than I remember it. The lack of spirits must have broken the cycle of nature. To the people of Olympias, this is what nature looks like. When I first laid eyes on the forests of Rizamaxia, I could barely comprehend what I was seeing. So this is the world that Spyrix has given you. Go ahead and say it. We brought this on ourselves. That may be true, but still... Look! Something green for once! Yeah, but I wouldn't expect to see a big forest anytime soon. Hmm. I believe there was a, um... Was it a... A devil beast back in that area? I'm gonna find out. And maybe... I'll be fighting that next. All right, we're back into it, and then make sure the I always check because I'm always doing something off when I'm not recording. So I'm getting pretty tired here. Are we even going the right way? Oh yeah, because I was walking around doing things. Let me make sure I'm in the right area. For uh, sale, yeah. As you can tell on the mini map that I've already did a little exploring in this area, so I'm not gonna. Get caught up looking for things. <clears throat> and I fought those cute little purple ducks. <laughs> squishy, 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 squishy. Alright, I haven't been in this part, so I will do some looking around. Four black feathers. I don't know how far. I think it's. I gotta reach 400. I might just get the trophy soon. I have to see the uh, the trader guy first. The one that wants the black feathers. But yeah. Let's see here. Oh wow! I don't think I've ever seen one in plain sight like that. Lemon gel. Yeah, Jew could use it. <laughs> they got that smooth jazz <laughs> playing on in the background. <laughs> Sound like it's blues night or something. <laughs> when I had uh, cut off the game last night, oh, pot of food. Uh, <clears throat> when I cut off the game last night, I realize how bland these open areas really are. Stay on guard. Ready? Got it. Go. Oh wow, somebody has to survive that in uh, normal mode. I just need to keep believing in myself. Actually, what is pot of food? 
Oh yeah, okay. I do kind of want to use that. There's a quote that she used to say, um, this is the power of Maxwell, last night, did I just see a rare enemy? No. But uh, last night I noticed uh, she said, uh, this is our power, so maybe now. <laughs> Referencing the fact that she's not really uh, Maxwell anymore. <laughs> Yeah, I want to see this. Oh, nice. Oh, I didn't realize that. Uh, yeah. We have no limit. Pretty cool. Not yet. I still need to get better. Okay, now let's go get this chest. Damn, did I go in that hole? I don't remember. And this is okay, it is large. <clears throat> Come on, I feel like that was wrong. Okay. <clears throat> you gotta take advantage of that free food, son. Uh, I keep forgetting that's not automatic when you go in there. It's so annoying. My, I saw, um, that was Eye of the Demon Beast. I saw something else just last night. I have something else, but they seem like special items, so it might actually be the same thing. Let me double check that. The new. Uh, the demon. Yeah, never mind. Uh, we've got 26 of them. Yeah, it's nothing special at all. <clears throat> Dimensional breach. It's Italian abyss. Where are we going to? I have no idea. Dimensional breach sounds more accurate than Italian abyss. But the uh, Italian uh, Abyss has the save point. And that's pretty hard to not assume not to, as not being the right way. <laughs> oh, I just saw something in the tree, I think. Uh, no, I'm tripping. I'm tripping. I'm sorry. My bad. My bad. All right, so let's go towards the save point. <clears throat> no holes in the wall. Oops, wrong side. Just a few more black feathers. <clears throat> a few more as in like 40 something. Migrant plume. No. <laughs> I just noticed that I'm actually getting like three of those at a time too. Dang. <clears throat> Meadow crystal. See that sparkly at the end? I 
Ah, this is what I've been looking for. Rare boots. <clears throat> Whoa! Oh, and he's not chasing me? That's a special guy. I wonder if I can actually get encounter linked by that one. <clears throat> yeah, he's one of those spirits, like the one I thought was a um a devil beast. He's not one for sure. Gratic claw. It's so big. Well, I must say. What? What is it? This bear is there. I don't think we have time for any jokes. <laughs> this bear is bear. <laughs> uh, oh, sorry, I'm the only healer. And I don't have them using items. Jeez. <laughs> We have to switch. I'm taking Alvin out. I'll stop them in their trap. Go, Hit him with the slide. Tornado blade. Ruination I wish I could wake them up. I was really close. Hmm. That's pretty easy. I'll overcome anything. There's always room for improvement. But yeah, at this point, anything is easy. <clears throat> Destroyer of evil. All right, let me cut this video off so I remember to separate it in the uh, in my playthrough. No. All right. Again, I didn't really do anything just now. I just cut the video off so that I could use it as a marker to remember that uh, something happened. Because usually I don't check the full video. I just check to see what's happening at the end. And then I edit it out or edit things. And then, see, I didn't even save it. I didn't even think about it. I, was, I just hit stop. And then I went back to recording ASAP. Like I said, I just wanted to make sure that I knew what I was doing when it came time to the editing. Mm. September 3rd. That Rayman Legends came out today. Or is coming out. I wish I got an indication if I was going the right way or not. <clears throat> I'm just going to walk a little bit in here. And if they don't say anything, I'm turning around. What the hell is that? Oh, no, it's just a... Yeah. These things are ugly. Actually, I want to fight them. Oh yeah, I can do wind snap in the air. I have the demon beast. All right, I'm up. That thing is fast. Clear 
Yo, Jude is sick. Infernal dance. Okay, let's keep moving. A friend of mine told me that it was, I guess, said in forums or in a guide that Jude is apparently broken. I don't know if I'd agree, but yeah, he is, he is, uh, he definitely benefits from being able to handle close combat better than everybody else. Although when I played as Mila, I think she's really good too, especially if you know what you're doing. The fact that she can turn... I'm sorry, I'm going for these items. <laughs> but, but the fact that uh, she can turn her um, her spirit arts or like her, her casting into actual moves, I don't know, in my opinion, makes her dope. Like, I don't know what that one move she did. I think it's Rock Trine, which is supposed to make that triangle uh, floor on the ground and then rocks spew up from the bottom. To me, and then you can just press circle without hold. You can just tap circle or the casting, and becomes pretty much a grave. And it's a physical attack, so you can use it in combos. Like she's effective, really effective. But and then her aerial aerial skills are better than Jude's, in my opinion. I saw the dimensional rift back there. I just wanted to see what, if anything was over here hiding. Surprisingly, not like that was a beautiful spot do some uh, deceptive things so I imagine I could uh, teleport between the worlds now he said he found a sprawl at the foot of this hill let's look for a path down what's that I'm mad they didn't notice we must have fallen from there to the bottom of the cliff isn't the rift a little small my guess is it's about to collapse. Jumping back through would be a leap of faith. Count me out! It looks too dangerous! Let's head back to town and figure out another way. I swore it was bigger, but hey. Hey, everyone. If you plan on returning to Risa Maxia, then I think it's time we parted ways. What? What makes you say that all of a sudden? I know that we pulled off a successful Spyrite tethering together, and we found out some great news. But I'm afraid the only way to stop Gaius at this point is to fight him. I don't want the way you feel now to get in the way of your true feelings. I agree. If we can't be honest with ourselves about why we're fighting, then there's no point in fighting in the first place. In other words, you want us to make our own decision. It'll be a difficult ride ahead. I guess it only makes sense. <sighs> but we must Might stick have together. Have some more time to think. At least until you're all ready to leave. Sure. Of course. Don't let your current emotions get in the way. <laughs> I'm almost acting human. Mila? Sorry, it's nothing. Oh, uh, did Wait, it fall from her leg? Isn't this? There's no way replacing everything Spyrix with Spyrites is going to be easy as it sounds. In terms of raw numbers, just think of how many Spyrites we'll need. It's true. The Spyrites need to be researched, created, distributed. It won't happen overnight. There is much that needs to be done. But if we can't buy more time, the spirits will go extinct. I will buy us time. Maxwell said it himself. If we remove the schism, the mana that it contains could sustain Olympias for a considerable amount of time. And that's what you intend to do? 
Yes, it is. It's a long road ahead for all of us. But the more pressing problem is Gaius. If we can't stop him, it'll be too late for Olympias. Yeah. So does it say anything? Nope. I swear I saw something in the trees. But that could just be my paranoia. Paranoia of missing anything. So back to town. Balin's apartment. <laughs> I guess I'm teleporting. <laughs> Triglyph. I don't understand. The spirit fossil came off. How is she able to continue walking? Probably because she was reincarnated or something. Or for whatever reason, she's back. I don't even remember them discussing that. If they, I don't think they did it at all. I want answers. Damn it. Okay. Got the general items back. Let's go see what Balin's talking about. Hmm. Let's try and make sure there's no new quest. It doesn't seem to be. friends here. Interesting. Now, oh. <laughs> On the swing sets. What are you doing, Alvin? Figured I'd stay away since everyone's so sick of me. Maybe because you're a big fat liar. <laughs> yeah, that's just who I am, all right. And what about you, Elise? Wondering what to do? Yeah, I just don't know what the right choice is. Well, you're talking to the wrong guy. I don't know much about being a kid. Never really had a childhood. So were you a member of Exodus ever since you were just a little boy? Yeah, that's right. I thought it was okay to trick people. When things would go bad, I'd just disappear. I'd take the path of least resistance. I pretty much just did whatever didn't hurt me, that's all. Then... Does that mean you won't be going with Mila and Jude? He doesn't know. You know what? That kid forces me to wake up and smell reality. They're all just so mature. The way they hide their real feelings about me. Oh, now I get it. You're lonely, aren't you, Alvin? <laughs> I've never been much for expressing my feelings, I suppose. But even if they do hate me, I have to stick it out. I'm not leaving this time. So does that mean that you really want to be their friend again? I've learned that building real trust with people takes a lot more work than you think. Being a grown-up sounds like an awful lot of pain. <laughs> it seems like the older you get, the tougher it is to share your feelings with others. Anyway, no one will want to be friends with me until I can make the first move. It's hard. 
But it sure beats being alone. I wonder... what I'm supposed to do now. What do I have to do to become happy? Well... It's different for everyone. You just have to find what works for you. I'm sure you know what you want by now. I guess so. It hasn't been easy, but I've learned a lot traveling with everybody. <laughs> I know that. I definitely don't want to stop, that's for sure. I want to keep on learning more, and I want to make some new friends. Yeah, that sounds pretty good to me. Some help you are. <laughs> I told you, I'm the wrong guy to ask about this stuff. Sorry about that, kid. Huh? That's a thank you. I just wanted you to know that from now on, I'm gonna be your friend, okay? <laughs> How come the kids are the wisest people in this group? Well, two moons or just planets in the distance? Rowan and Leia. Trouble sleeping, young miss? Yeah, I still haven't made up my mind. What about you? I've reached a decision. I have decided to go with them. You better believe I see. it. I wonder if I'm the only one who's still on the fence. You're not alone. Huh? When Lord Klein passed away, I inherited the keys to the kingdom along with many doubts. But eventually you figured out what to do, right? I used to think that everything works out if you do your best, but I've been proven wrong every time. Does Agria still haunt you? I keep thinking, there might have been something else I could have done for her. I know that feeling well. Oh, you mean with King Noctigal? <laughs> Am I that easy to read? Let me tell you, life does not become any simpler the older you get. But I must say, I am a bit surprised by you. In what way? I was under the impression that Jude was the one who occupied your every waking thought. Uh, come on now, don't be silly! Is it obvious? Yes, I'm afraid it is. <laughs> you know, I once thought that if I became a nurse, that I might find happiness. After all, when Jude's happy, I'm happy. Simple enough, right? But now, I'm starting to get the feeling that Jude just might be better off without me. I mean, I don't want to get in his way again, you know? Leah. Would you like to know what my reasons are and why I've decided to go along with Jude and Mila? Are you willing to tell me? I would like to be there to walk with them in the future that they wish to create. <laughs> that sounds like you. But that's not all. Huh? I plan to take the lead and pull the two of them along behind me. That is my true desire. And I? What do I really want? I think you already know your answer, miss. What I really want is to see Jude's smiling face again. <laughs> I suppose that's it. That's a good reason, isn't it? Damn. Teddy loves Mila. At least that's what it seems like. 
They'll never touch on the fact, I guess, or we'll see now. It's about to be theirs. But Leia just looks screwed in the whole <laughs> predicament. Like, like she has no chance with Jude. Hey. Don't you want to sit? And they get the special music. You've changed. Not really. To be honest, I'm so scared I can't even sleep. I told you before, if we can just dispel the schism, I'll handle everything from there. There's no reason for you to be afraid. Mila! If the schism disappears, so will the temporal crossroads, right? Yes. The destruction of the schism means the death of Maxwell. The Why? temporal crossroads were born from Maxwell and that unique spirit climb, so they will vanish too. Let me show my Why? control as not go to sleep. Why didn't I realize what's happened to you? Hmm? I know. You never told me because... because you wanted me to find my own answer first. Isn't that right? Mila? It was just easier for me that way. She <gasps> never been using it or something, right? The entity known as Maxwell is essential for the spirits. So they will need a new Maxwell. Then we won't be able to stay together anymore? The sadness of parting is a human emotion. Such emotions no longer apply to me. Uh-huh. And there's no other way. Is there? <laughs> if he starts crying. <laughs> Maxwell created me, so... Perhaps he could restore my human body. Jude, is that what you really want? Let's create a new future for all the spirits and people in the world. And let's create it together. Together. Haha. <laughs> Gaius! Just relax. I've come here to tell you something, and that's all. Well? What then? We are ready to commence our operation to wipe out every Spyrex in Olympias. So your attack from before was just to check whether Spyrites were usable? Exactly. You came here to tell us that? No. Listen. You have a dream for the future of the world that is vastly different from mine. So... Take it easy. This is a piece of Muse's power. The power to slice through space? What of it? Here, I give you a chance to return to Risa Maxia quietly if you choose to. <laughs> You'd still offer us a chance to end things peacefully. Gaius, you know full well that we can't walk the same path. Not anymore. If you wish to make your dream a reality, then come and face me. 
I won't run, and I won't hide. Wait. What about Muse? She is very torn. She has incredible power, yet she knows not how to use it. In hindsight, I was cruel to force such a weak person to become strong so suddenly. He wants to save her too, doesn't he? Hey. Hmm? I know I might just be fighting for selfish reasons now. But I know that I have to go face Gaius. Oh yeah, let's go kick that butt. <laughs> I need to get a grip on these fragile feelings. Otherwise, I won't become the adult I want to be. So, Mila... If I ever stray from my path, promise me that you'll be there to remind me who I really am. I will. So I guess we go to fight guys. Sleep well? Yes. That might have been the best sleep I've had in my entire life. I was dead to the world. <laughs> I decided I'm coming with you. I won't bore you with my reasons, though. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Leia. Let's do our best. Yep. I'm coming too. And me three. I shall accompany you as well. Wouldn't do for the only Olympian here to sit this one out. So you've made up your minds. As if we'd have it any other way. Then there's something we need to tell you. Check this out. Nifty knife. Gaius brought this to us last night. He called it a piece of Muse's power. Does that mean we could use it to tear open the breach? Looks like it. Gaius truly is inscrutable. He's mocking us. I don't think so. We might be fighting against one another, but he's a good guy. Nice to see you're actually talking to me. Uh, uh well... I appreciate it. Thanks. You're welcome. It's a bummer there's nobody here to send off the heroes! <laughs> that shouldn't be a problem. We'll just have to accept that we're unsung heroes. Who needs an adoring crowd? Let's have a pre-battle cheer! If you insist... Couldn't hurt. Make sure to put some feeling into it! Indeed. Here goes nothing. Everyone, let's finish what we started! Yeah! yeah. I wonder if I'm actually that close to the end of the game now. <laughs> Musing about Muse. Muse seems to have fallen completely under Gaius' control. I'd say it's more that Muse has finally found someone she can rely on. She had been yearning for someone to guide her. That girl has some big time dependency issues. <laughs> She's like my own dark shadow. I wish we could have met under different circumstances. Whatever the nature of their relationship, Muse's ability to manipulate dimensional space is now in Gaius's hands. That is no trivial matter. Agreed. Even the Great Spirits are no match for a blade that can sever dimensional barriers. That doesn't sound promising. Should we turn tail and run away? Yes, let's do that. <laughs> do you really think I would say such a thing? Of Never course not. You know me well. <laughs> Oh, yeah! Snag something good! 
Is it really okay to steal like that? Of course it is! We won that battle fair and square! Yikes. So might makes right, huh? Does that mean if we lose, the enemy might take something of ours? Yep. If we were to lose, the enemies could have Tipo. What? <laughs> you can't take Tipo without my permission! We'll let them have your hairband! Hey, that's off limits! I had to save up my allowance for weeks to buy this. It's my number one favorite. But I'm everyone's number one favorite! <laughs> fine, fine. If we lose, we'll just have to sacrifice Alvin's coat. The hell you will. I love this thing. <laughs> so why did that just come up? Did I get... Whoa. It's different and highlighted green and things. Okay. So what was I looking for? Oh yeah, something about Okay. Item thief, where's career thief? Master criminal. Nope, nowhere near this one. I wonder why that came up. I wonder what's the mass. So can I travel now? Uh Looks nice. Where am I going? Head for the dimensional breach. Can I just travel there? Yes, I can. So let's save. Go to the dimensional breach. See if anything's popping off. I should probably switch it back to hard mode just in case at the dimensional breach is a boss battle. Or if uh, going through the dimensional breach. There's a boss battle at the, on the other side or something like that. Roussel High Road. Huh. Jude, you're up. Yikes. Can we look before we leap? Less looking, more leaping. <laughs> She's uh, really go not first. so fast. What now? You really think we can beat Gaius and Muse like this? I forgot don't to change the, the, the difficulty. Feet. I don't think that's what he's implying. Do we need to take care of any business back in Riza Maxia? We can go back? Yes, we can probably return to Riza Maxia from the Temporal Crossroads. Alvin has a point. We cannot expect help from anyone. In other words, we must be fully prepared. Right. We gotta think these things through. We're on our own after all. Good point. Okay, so... Ready, everyone? Last one in has to kiss Tipo. <laughs> hey, no fair. I got you. No need to worry. We're all bound for the same destination. Guess we'll never get the knack for doing things as a group. Hey, it's worked for us so far. I guess you're right. Well, looks like we're up. <laughs> I thought we were split up. Mm. Hey, nice of you to join us. Either we ended up in a different place from last time, or it got a major remodel. Gaius must have used Maxwell's power to alter things here. Where's Leia? Where'd you go? I found another breach like the one we came through. Don't tell me you went in it. 
I did. It leads to Riza Maxia, so that's the wrong way. Then Gaius and Muse must be that way. This presents a dilemma. I assumed we would just be following the same path as last time. At your age, Rowan, never assume things will be easy. <laughs> <laughs> well said. We have other dangers to contend with besides Gaius and Muse. Better keep our guard up. Let's go, everyone. <sighs> so. But which way is the right way? I, I imagine they'll tell me. The vacant throne. Guys has been busy keeping order in Rashagal ever since Noctagal died. I wonder what's going on back at his old castle in Kanbalar. You sure you don't need to stop by Neakara for anything? Actually, it has been a while since I've shown my face around town. I wouldn't mind seeing how everyone's doing. Well, when we have a chance, let's make the trip. Uh, okay, I gotta remember, remember three visit. things. Why? Are you hoping to hear one of his humiliating stories about my past? The more you bring it up, the more curious we get. Okay, so three things. Uh, four things. Okay, I got it. I could certainly Start eat. Writing, writing then why something. not come to my house? I'm sure my dad's cooked up something. Uh, okay, so I got like four things to remember. What the hell is that? Oh, it's a treasure chest. Okay, so which one is this? 